What's up guys, iDevice Help here and today in this video I'm going to be showing you guys how to place your icons on your iPhone's home screen anywhere that you want. As you can see here I have a blank space right in the center of my iPhone's home screen. Now Apple does not allow you to do this, all the icons have to be in a row and if you're jailbroken you can do this but in this video I'm going to be showing you guys without a jailbreak supports all versions of iOS 9. Let's get started. So the first thing I want to want you to do is go ahead and jump into settings, general, accessibilities and right here where it says reduce motion tap on that and turn it on now once you do that go ahead and tap and hold on one of the icons until you go into edit mode and as you can see there you can't place the icons anywhere you want they all just fall in a row but anyway go all the way to the end and take a screenshot by pressing on the power and home button together okay so now we have a screenshot in the video description down below I'll have this website here once you get to this website go ahead and click customize the next thing you want to do is go ahead and hit custom mode, then modify. And right here where it says choose file, go ahead and click choose file. And we're going to select the screenshot that we just took from our home screen. So go to screenshots, select your screenshot, and then click upload. Once it uploads, go ahead and select the part of the screenshot that you want to create an icon for. So basically we're creating icons and creating an illusion that there's a spot empty there, but there's basically an icon that pertains to that particular part of the screenshot. So once you click on the section that you want, you go ahead and click down here on the share options and then add to home screen. There it is, the image of the part. Go ahead and click add. And now we have that particular section of uh, the wallpaper that you see there. It creates an illusion that makes it look like there's nothing there. There's really just an icon that pertains to that particular part of the screenshot. Now, if you want to keep creating screenshots or icons, go ahead and click back and then it'll take you back to the page and keep creating icons until you get as many as you need or as many as you want. Now I've already pre-created a couple here uh, for the sake of the video just to kind of show you how I can get that effect here on my device and go ahead and put them all on the springboard here. And as you take a look here, that is how I create that effect. Very cool, very neat. This is how you place any icon on any part of the springboard of your iPhone by creating this very cool illusion. And there you guys have it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, like always, don't forget to click that like button. Much more videos coming your way. Of course, be sure to stay tuned. It's been iDevice Help, and I will catch you guys on the next one. Peace.